Hello guys, Sunrise here and in today's video I will show you how to import replays in a much easier way with the file manager because some people uh, said in the latest video that there is a much easier way to do this with the file manager which I did also include in the description that I will make a part two of the tutorial in which I show how to do it with the file manager which is really much easier. So now over here I've got the Osudroid Daninite um, course which is for down basically. And as you can see I don't have any replays on this. So now uh, the file manager I'm gonna be using is called Z Archiver, I believe. So what you want to do is uh, well go into the device memory, go and download. Here is the replay that I downloaded, which is from uh, the Osudroid uh, International server in the Dan Courses channel because I was too lazy to ask my friend and wait for him to send me uh, exported play again. So I just decided I'd scroll a bit through the Dan Courses and find the replay myself. So over here is the replay uh, of Biggies FCing uh, for Dan with Precise. So how do you export? Uh, how do you import the score? You basically click on it, there's this little arrow over here next to view, you want to click that and then it's going to give you the options to open with different apps. Now if you just uh, click view, it's just going to show you the interior of uh, the, the EDR file, which is basically an entry.json and the also droid the uh, replay itself. But now that's not important. Maybe I'll make a video on that uh, like sometime later. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know much about Druid, but yeah, I'll think about it. I'll, I'll see if I can learn anything about that. I'll ask the developers and etc. Okay, so as we said, you can click this arrow over here and it's gonna give you the options to open with different apps and etc. So here you can see import replay into also Droid. There's actually two options, which one is for Osudroid and the other one is for Osudroid Debug, if you have uh, the Osudroid Debug, because those two are two separate apps, that's why you have two options over here. But that's not important now. Now we want to import it into Osudroid. Let's see how this works. Import the replay successfully. Okay, uh, so now hopefully the next time we open Osudroid, the replay is going to be there. Since I haven't tested this out yet, I don't really know. I'm not, uh, I haven't really imported that much replays. But let's see. Yep, there it is. And you can watch it, you can enjoy it, and it's much easier than going through the whole replay importing shenanigans. So yeah, my name has been Sunrise and I hope I, help, I helped you again. I'll think about making the next tutorial and etc. I'll try doing some like uh, tutorials more frequently because my channel has been pretty dead lately. I haven't been uploading in like a freaking eternity. Plus that I really want to start <laughs> waking up the channel again because I see people. There's people that go around the channel, they watch, they comment and I feel like I'm kind of betraying my channel when I'm not uploading for a long time. And because I'm only uploading replays and stuff, I was thinking if I should start uploading more frequently. So instead of just uploading replays, I guess I'll upload a replay plus something something special. Like this time this tutorial. So yeah, that's my thoughts on this. Anyway, my name has been Sunrise and I hope I helped you. We'll see you in the next video.